The new Wayfarer's bobble art was stolen and the original artist was the one who discovered it. On November 18th, 2023, at 8.38am, Lorenzo LaFranconi shared this post that the artist for the new Wayfarer's bobble art stole their illustration. Now if you flip the image, it's very accurate to the original piece. So I actually did my own experiment. I used Photoshop's opacity feature and layered the images on top of each other and aligned them. It is obvious this is the same piece of art. And by definition, this is plagiarism. The practice of taking someone else's work or ideas and passing them off as one's own. The people that commented are not happy with what happened as we see here. They're hoping the artist that stole it would be fired, hiring Lorenzo, and getting them compensated instead, or that the artist really didn't alter the original piece at all. And Lorenzo's not looking for any compensation, just the truth. On November 20th, 2023, Wizards of the Coast released a statement on the situation. We recently became aware of the claims that David Sondra's artwork on the car Wayfarer's Bobble used art created by another artist without that artist's permission. Such misuse of art is expressed prohibited by our artist guidelines it does not reflect the values of Wizards of the Coast. As such, we will be suspending any future work with David Sondrid until further notice. Lorenzo's art was stolen, the original art was horizontally flipped, and Lorenzo was not credited, thus being plagiarized artwork. Wizards of the Coast acknowledged the situation and suspended David Sondrid until further notice. Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments down below.